What is up, peeps? Maskerman101 and... Input Spark 3. And we're in a things to do in Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of the Duelist. And we, I call this one Mulligan. Now, uh, for those of you who play Magic, Mulligan is like if you open up a bad hand, you get basically shuffle it back into the deck and reset. Hey, Vincent, how what? much was this game? It was 20 bucks. Hearthstone doesn't make you pay 20 bucks. Well, you know what? Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> says, okay, um, this is important right here, so... I'm at 63,357, and this is basically a whole pack reset exploit that um, I found. Um, basically, you can open as many packs as you want, and if you don't get the card you want, you can just reset, get your money back, and then just keep opening. So, I'm opening the Alexis Rhodes Booster Pack because I want Necros cards, because they're really good. Like, the deck is, in real life is crazy. It's, like, at the top of the uh, competitive charts. And it searches itself, it has... You know, it has a lot. You can like get resources back easily. It's pretty. It's a pretty dumb deck. So, um, um, I'm getting a lot of just like junk cards here that I don't want, or I'm getting some decent cards that I already have. So, I actually get one right here, Necros Kaleidoscope, which is one of the cards like you actually need in the deck. But I already have all that I need, so I just move on. Another important thing to can uh, to remember uh, this uh, this glitch is that you can't exit this menu whatsoever. If you exit the menu. Um, you will not find any way to get your money back. So, you're probably wondering, it's like, oh, how you pull this off? So, what you want to do is, you want to exit out, and you want to literally sign out of your account. Now, you you want to press the button as you're in the menu. You don't want to go back into the main menu, or That's else important. it won't work. Yeah. So, as you can see, I signed out of my account, and I'm going to sign back in, and I'm going to choose my account, obviously. And, um... I'm going to log back in the Legacy of the Duelist, and it'll give you a message that's like, oh, the sign-out has fucked up the game. So then I've got to log back in, and there you go. Have all your money back. 63357 I lost no money. So I'm going, to show you, I'm going to show you that this works consistently. So I'm at 61357 Now I'm going to go after a card called Supply Squad, which, I'm going to be honest, a lot of these cards are super hard to pull. Like, the ratios are, are ridiculously stupid. It's just like, this This is one of the cards where you have a very low chance of pulling it. Didn't you say it took you 20 minutes to get this? Yeah, it took me literally 20 minutes to pull this one card. And, um, the card I'm looking for is a card called Supply Squad. It's a spell card where if monster or monsters, plural, are destroyed, you get to draw a card. And it's pretty good, so it's like, it makes your opponent hesitant on destroying your monsters because you just get resources. And if you have three of them on, one monster equals, like, three extra cards. It's stupid. So, I'm opening packs, and I'm getting a lot of, like, really crappy cards. Like, I'm getting a lot of monsters that require, like, tributes, and they have, like, attacks of, like, what is that, like, less than 1,500, and they don't do anything. So, it's, like, really, really, like, a lot of the older cards before, like, yo, know, like, the game got complicated. So, as you can see, I'm opening, like, a bunch of normal monsters, and, hey, I pull Pot of Greed, like, one of the most busted cards in the game. Um, so, yeah... That's basically it. I don't consider really. I don't really consider this like cheating. I think it's just more like a reset because it's still random. It's just it gives you a better. It gives you like you know more of a shot of pulling like the card you want. So I do the trick again, and I am at sixty one thousand three hundred and fifty seven again. And I've got fast forward to when I actually pull the card, so I so I can show you what what this card looks like. So I pull it right here. I'm super excited because I actually want to do something else with my life. Besides sitting on my ass and opening virtual card packs. <laughs> so, um... What's per turn if a monster you control is destroyed by battle or by card effect? You get to draw a card. Pretty good card. So see that's it guys. for this video. If you want to go see more, go to AchievementHunter.com or the Community Hunter and watch your stuff.